and then we're going to do try and we're going to have catch exception A and we're going to say J option pane dot show message dialog and it's going to be null and here is going to be E so we're going to write in here so we're going to say file image equals new file file name and we're going to say file input stream and we'll call it fix uh, equals new file input stream image then we're going to say byte array output stream bos equals new byte array output stream and then we're going to say byte buff equal new byte and we're going to say 1024 now for int uh, number number equals fix dot read the buff and then not equals minus one and then we do this, close it, and then you're going to say BOS dot write buff zero and the number. And then you're going to go in here. And you're going to say person underscore image equal BOS dot to array. And we got an error here. here just do this and there you go so uh, let's test it out and see uh, what's what's gonna happen but first we're gonna add the code so we can insert uh, the value or the image to our database so you're gonna scroll up here to our code and here under here you're gonna say uh, PST dot set bytes bytes and you're gonna say 8 and it's person image so you're gonna save that and you're gonna run and you're gonna say attach and it's gonna open it here and I'm gonna go to my desktop and let's say copper there you go but we have we have our label here so we're gonna close that and we're gonna go back and we're gonna do F2 and we're gonna delete this and we're gonna save uh, we're gonna run again and attach uh, desktop uh, we're gonna go here copper whatever see it fits to the screen so if I wanna open up copper image and see how big it is uh, there you go here you can see that it's quite big so if you have any image it's gonna put it there 
So we're going to try and put this image into our database too. So if we say uh, copper and the surname is a Don and is a male. I'm not going to fill out all those, but I'm going to add the record and see what happens. Okay. So hopefully it added the image <laughs> inside the database. So we're going to check our database as the database and you can see that here it added the image and it's blob and this is the size so thank you for watching uh, this tutorial uh, don't forget to like subscribe and stay tuned for more